Hey you guys, it's Heather from Figuring Chic Out and this morning I'm doing a review on the breast pump bottle system that I've been using with our son Luke. So I have um, two of them set up. So one, it's like ready to go. There's no breast milk in this one, but you could put breast milk or formula and this is what it's gonna look like when you're ready to feed. So this is how it looks put together and I'm gonna talk about that and then also the warmer and then the pieces. So if you buy the starter kit, which I highly recommend, it's gonna come with two of the bottle holder adapters, two of the slow flow, slow flow nipples, and two of the fast flow, and then also some of the bags. I will say probably within two weeks of pumping, I ran out of those, but you can actually get these on Amazon Prime. So it's really easy when you run out to get more. The other reason why I recommend getting the starter kit is it comes with this. This is the Kind Cozy, and it's actually the only warmer on the market that's made for breast milk, and I'll get into that a little bit later. So basically what you're gonna do is figure out the type of breast pump you have if you are nursing, and it comes with all the attachments. So I'm actually using the Spectra S1, but it's got them for Lansino, Medela, and a couple of other ones. It's all included in the kit. And so that's gonna attach to the flange. And all you have to do is unscrew that off and then screw it to the adapter and then that goes and collects when you're pumping. So this is what it's gonna collect and store in. And also I kind of got a confidence boost when I first started pumping. I didn't realize that you actually have to open up the bottom like this for collecting. So I was kind of freaked out when my baby was two weeks old and I was pumping like five ounces of milk. But once you actually open the bottom part up, it'll drop down and you're like, oh, okay, I'm only at two ounces or two and a half right now. Um, so that's one of the things that you just kind of have to be careful with if you're measuring. Um, we haven't given our baby any formula, but I know that I've read some other reviews and talked to other moms saying that if you're using this to measure out the water, it's not always as accurate. So you might wanna use uh, like a Pyrex measuring thing to pour the water in so you know you're getting the exact amount. Moving on, uh, this is what it's gonna look like when you take it out of the fridge or the freezer and you just drop it into the cozy and there's water in here, it has a plug. And then it also has this timer. So you set the timer and the water actually bubbles up and circulates around. So it evenly heats your breast milk and it keeps it at a steady 60 degrees um, Celsius or Fahrenheit, sorry, so that um, it doesn't spoil the breast milk. So once it's heated, you're gonna take it out and then it's got one side is like this. And then the other side actually has this little insert in here. So you're going to pop this up in here and it just clicks into place like this. Oops, it's hard to do it backwards <laughs> for the camera. I'm not a professional. So it pops in like this and then all you have to do is screw the cap off like that. And then this is their little um, travel for the nipple. This pops off. And then you've got the actual, I'm using a slow flow, nip, slow flow nipple. And then this is the cover, but you just pop this on like so, and you're ready to go. The one tip that I saw from the website that they actually recommend is when there's breast milk in it, if it's not full all the way to the top, which I haven't experienced yet, you actually flip it over and squeeze it, or no, don't flip it over. Squeeze it first to get all the air out and then flip it over so all you're left with is milk. And that way you get rid of colic because there's no air for it to be in the bag. So that's a plus of the bag versus using a bottle because in a bottle you can't get rid of that air. Whereas in the bag, you can squeeze all the air out, flip it over and you're ready to go. If you're on the go and you're using it, just pop the cap on and wait till you get home and you can clean it. But really, this is it. The only thing that you're cleaning is this nipple. This is gonna pop off, drop into the recycling bin, and you're done. So thanks for watching my video. If you